And in 1995, Nick DiNapoli opened up a local restaurant here, uh, DiNapoli's Firehouse Eatery. Used it as a static display outside of his restaurant. Unfortunately, the tragic events of 9-11 occurred. And with Nick and his close ties to New York and the fire service, came up with the idea of, of creating a memorial, if you will, um, to pay tribute to the 343 brothers that we lost on that tragic day. It's sat here ever since. Our community loves it. We get multiple, I mean, it's nationally known, so we get multiple visitors here at the fire station and they come to visit, they take pictures in front of it. What we do here locally is we'll place flowers or a wreath out front just to show our respects to the 343. Our community is great. They come, they set candles out, they set their own flowers out. And it's just a, an awesome way. Uh, Nick came up with the idea, as you see, um, the helmet is an exact replica of the Texaco fuel station helmet, uh, the fire chief helmet that Carnes made uh, in the 1960s. Um, Nick has kind of renovated it and made it look identical to what the FDNY wear today. Um, to our knowledge, it's one of the only ones left. There was only a few made, um, and all the research I've ever done, and I'm talking to Nick DiNapoli, who is a historian of the fire service in general. This is one of the only ones out there and it is one of the largest tributes that a uh, fire department has for 9-11. Uh, we're here at, located at 861 Barso Road in Barso, California. It's our headquarters fire station 361. We're very proud of it and and if you uh, are ever in the city of Barso, come on by and check it out and it's definitely uh, worth your trip in tribute to, again, the 343 brothers that we lost on September 11, 2001.